alone. Hey, Lou, thanks for being such a good role model. Are you a good witch or a bad witch? I really don't think we have time for this. Give me that nose slippers. How much of this stuff did you inhale? I didn't inhale any. I just like doing the voice. Mom, I have a question. There might be some girls here tonight, so which shirt? This is the ugly shirt I own, Mom. That was a test. Why don't you just wear the nice shirt your grandma sent you? This is the one grandma sent me. Uh, Matt, just put on a shirt. Matt, I like the one you have on. Andy, will you come help me with the dip? The dip will be fine as soon as he picks a shirt. <laughs> okay, Lou, what are we forgetting? Claire. Claire, will you calm down? Everything is going to be fine. Okay. I just don't want us to screw up. Well, what, what is the big deal? Well, let's just say that I owe Joe a good birthday. You don't think he's figured it out, do you? Oh, Claire, I don't want to scare you, but sometimes I still catch Joe and Lloyd playing Got Your Nose. <laughs> and more than once, the game has ended in tears. <laughs> You're right. Everything is going to be fine, I promise, all right? Just as long as Lloyd has him back by 8.30. I can't believe it's 8.15. You know what I can't believe? I can't believe how lame that party was. I mean, I bet Lyle throws Eric a better party this year. <laughs> Come on, Joe. Everybody tried to make it nice. In fact, why don't we go home and tell them? Yeah, well, at least it wasn't the worst birthday I've ever had. Remember when I came here to celebrate my 16th? Oh, yeah. Your father couldn't talk about anything else for weeks. We hadn't really gotten along that well since he married Claire, you know, and then I come here and I see him doing all the stuff with Matt and Andy that I thought he should be doing with me, you know. So I got a little jealous. I mean, you know. Yeah, I felt the exact same way when you were born. Let's take Joey to the park. Let's tuck Joey into bed. Oh, don't eat that applesauce, Lloyd. That's for Joey. I'm sorry, go on. <laughs> It's just that I felt like a reject from, like, Dad's first experimental family or something, you know? So I act like a jerk. He tried to discipline me, but I wasn't going to have any of that. I mean, you know, he wasn't my father anymore. So that's why you left early. Yeah. You know, I... I always thought that I'd be able to see him again. He'd be able to talk about it. He died. No, it's amazing. <laughs> you give all the time in the world, right? <sighs> what am I doing? What am I talking about over here, right? Is it not my birthday it's or your what? It's birthday. You know what? I want to have a party. Let's have a party, yes. okay? Let's you know have what? a party. We're going to start off with a few more drinks, have another orange juice, Lloyd. Come no, on, no, Joe, Joe. Going. No, no. Mickey! Oh. Something's wrong. Matt, are you sure you invited all of Joe's friends? Yep, I snuck into his room one night and grabbed his address book. Matt, by any chance, does Joe have two address books? Yeah. See, I figured he missed the big one, so I grabbed the little one, copied all the numbers down, and put it right back. Hold a second. This little book. Black? black. Yes. Yes, it is. <laughs> oh, my God, you don't think. Oh, yeah. Leave it to Joe Roman to have the last little black book in America. <laughs> Hi. 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 <laughs> Matt, do you realize that all the girls that Joe's been dating are going to be in the same room at the same time? It was who he had in the book. I was told to get the book. I was following orders. Is this going to be a problem for Joe? Not after tonight. <laughs> uh, Claire, I owe you an apology. There was something that could go wrong. <laughs> okay, nobody panic. This is a serious situation that calls for serious action. Claire, listen, it's not a tragedy yet because these girls haven't started talking. All we have to do is distract them until Joe shows up, which is going to be any minute, and I'm sure we'll get away with this just fine. Hello? I can barely hear you, Lloyd. Oh, what do you mean you're running late? Claire, well, I'll do everything I can, but it's... but it's complicated. And that's why I did it for me. Boy, don't you know Sinatra's kicking himself for not recording that one. <laughs> Joe, we really ought to be going. Going? What are you, nuts? <laughs> this is my party, man. You know what? This is the exact kind of party I've always wanted. <laughs> Mickey, my good mouse. Having a round of drinks on me for all my new best friends, huh? What do you think? Uh, Claire, 
you didn't take that ice cream cake out of the freezer yet, did you? <laughs> Come on, Joe. Look, look at that. It's nine o'clock. It's time to go home. Nine o'clock, huh? Well, guess what? I got three more hours before my birthday's over. We're having a party here. <clears throat> hey, you know what? One more hour, we can hear the last call of the Waffle Hut. Really? No! <laughs> oh, yes! Who is the man? You the man, <laughs> you the That's man. right, I am the man. Give me a hug, big fella. Come on, here we go. <laughs> no, I've had enough. You know what? You're right, I have had enough. And you know why? Because I'm the man. <laughs> and you know what this man needs? This man needs a birthday kiss. So I'm just gonna go back here into my little black boogie, make a couple of call phones, find the lucky person who gets to give me that kiss, huh? Look